Hello there, this is Wasp Bloke and I want to show you a design I've come up with, a couple of variations on a design that I've come up with for the enchanting room, uh, a way of um, selecting uh, multiple uh, level variations depending on how many levels you want to use when you're enchanting items. Uh, in the new 1.3 update we only now need 15 bookcases um, to achieve uh, level 30 as the top level enchantment. So with that in mind um, what we've now got is a system that lends itself very well to binary addition because what we've got is 16 possible states with uh, bookshelves, either no bookshelves through to 15 bookshelves which is 16 total possible states that you'll have there so um, what we can do is use binary addition to uh, select as many or as few bookcases as, as we want. Um, so we, we can select um, one, two, four or eight bookshelves and any combination thereof allows us to achieve zero through to fifteen bookshelves being applied. Um, so if we bring up my... <coughs> excuse me. There we go. So there's one bookshelf. Two more. The next four and the last eight and then obviously if I take those two away I've got eight plus one equals nine and any combination thereof will get you um, whichever however many bookshelves you want. Um, as you can see in this design it's uh, sort of a sequential um, I've taken a sort of sequential route around the bookshelf so one uh, here, and then two, three, oops, four, five, six, seven, and then eight through to fifteen. So wrapping around in a loop. Uh, then the other design is simply uh, a posh looking variation on that where well, it's a more symmetrical feel going on. So one at the back, these two here, the four corners and then all the rest. So take out the four corners, take off the two front ones, take off the one at the back, take off the remaining eight. So the the wiring for each is relatively simple. This is probably the simpler wiring because we're just going sequentially around. So it's a bit easier to um, just manage the wiring around this um, this sort of series going around in series, not sequentially it's in series, I should say uh, this one's slightly more complicated um, uh, as you can see it's, it, there's a little bit more sort of fiddly work to do getting the wires to cross over and go around each other and complete the circuits that we need but yeah, that's it really um, two designs binary addition um, fairly straightforward, fairly simple. Um, somebody's probably thought of it before me, but anyway, I came up with this by myself with these designs. Uh, certainly my own designs. Uh, somebody more competent with redstone could probably compact the wiring and lose several blocks out of either of these wiring designs, make them slightly more economical. But there you go, I'll leave that for somebody else to come up with better wiring designs. Um, hope you've enjoyed. I uh, hope it gives you some ideas. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.